are going to try out a new recipe today. It is called Crock Pot Sweet Garlic Chicken. Um, but I'm actually going to try it out in my uh, Kasori. It's like an Instapot, but not an Instapot. I think it'll work out fine. One cup of brown sugar. Two thirds cup apple cider vinegar. Then it calls for one fourth a cup of lemon lime soda, which I don't have. So I'm just gonna make some sort of like lemon water concoction. I've just got some water and I'm gonna take. I just added a couple of squirts to the water. Then it calls for two to three two. tablespoons of minced garlic, two tablespoons of soy sauce. Last is one teaspoon of fresh ground pepper. Give that a good stir, and then you're gonna pour it all over about four to six chicken breasts. Make sure my valve is sealed. Last time I... So I am going to... So I've taken the chicken out of the Instapot, or Kasori, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to shred it up, and then I've taken the liquid, simmer this down, and add like a thickening agent to make it into like a, a gravy. And then I think we're going to go with rice. So I'm going to get some rice going in the Instapot now. I'm not going to clean it up, I'm just going to put the rice right in there with the water. So I have this seasoning packet three cups of cooked rice. So I'm gonna use, so this is a third of a cup, so I'll do. White rice. I will say one thing about this chicken. It is, it is very fragrant. You can smell it upstairs. I'm shredding the chicken because my husband, he doesn't really like big chunks of meat. I told him how you, not a big meat chunk fan. You like, you like someone cut your meat up for ya. I don't like big meat. All right, to make the thickening agent, I need two tablespoons of water and two tablespoons of cornstarch. Put that in there. So the recipe for the fried rice calls for a few slices of cooked bacon and green onions, of which I had neither. So I substituted um, a handful of bacon bits and some shallots from my garden. I figured it would add some similar flavor. Then you're going to add in the cooked rice and a packet of fried rice seasoning mix and stir it together really well. Then you just use the sauce that was made and you pour it over the chicken. 